Hey, this is Rare Elvis Photos, also known as Elvis 2022 channel here on YouTube. I uh, hope you enjoy this next video. Good morning, Elvis fans. I wanted to talk a little bit about Susan Henning and Elvis Presley and their love affair. Uh, they certainly did have a love affair. This is from the taping of the 68 Comeback Special. And I know there's been much to do lately about Priscilla and the Priscilla, so the Sofia Coppola movie. Um, but Elvis was not happy at this point in time with Priscilla. Uh, you know, she had had an affair six weeks after the birth of Lisa Marie Presley, according to Child Bride. Uh, and, of course, you know, he was a manly man that had pride. So, you know, there's a lot of flirtation going on with uh, with Susan and Elvis here. And, you know, according to Joe Esposito and others, they had a love affair, even though it was fairly brief. Um, you know, it was it, it was electric. And, um, and she has nothing but positive things to say about Elvis Presley um and obviously you know, it was captured Elvis for the whole world to see on the 68 comeback 67. special let's go ahead and, and hear I from Susan Henning and the bottom half of me was a mermaid everything he did he enjoyed life and he was certainly fun to work with and certainly very uh made you feel very comfortable in what you were doing if you were to air he would laugh and he's a very real person I'm attracted to people that aren't fake and and he seemed just down home and, and comfortable to be with. And Elvis started dating her, and he dated her for a while. Uh, not too many people know about that. She never told anybody about it. She was very, very quiet about it, and uh, we spent a lot of time together doing the movie and rehearsals and all that. And when I walked into the room, we were to practice and rehearse the dance. He had his back to me, and he had his little macho pose, and I think I had a pair of short shorts on. And I thought, oh, well, there's Elvis. We're going to have fun. So I remember walking up and sticking my leg between his leg and kind of doing the little can-can. And his favorite slogan was, he looked down at my boy, my boy. <laughs> they clicked for a while. And you could see uh, it in their eyes. I met him in uh, one time in Arizona we went. And I think a lot of his fun, since he was so much out, was just to be in. And we would really just stay in the room, and that sounds all perverted, but I mean, you can have a lot of fun in the room besides doing what people might think. I mean, just talking, and um, he loved to get into deep thoughts, of, of, and he loved to eat. One of my greatest uh, fun times was to comb his hair and do it in different ways that he had never worn it, and he thought that was so funny that I would comb his hair in bangs or um, part it down the center and make a butler or... I don't, we just played with each other. You could do fun things. I think he had a multitude of women, and, and I think I was one of, of I don't know, one so of So Susan many, Henning took it for what it was. Uh, a brief moment in time with Elvis Presley, uh, the real Elvis Presley. So the reason why I said the real Elvis Presley is because that's not the Elvis Presley that Priscilla accepted. She wanted the macho, rugged man, uh, that you know at times he probably was in his life and in the 50s he certainly was very uh very much a wildcat uh, but he was more emotionally intimate and really wanted to explore a relationship on a deeper level not a surface level and that's what priscilla was was she was a surface person and she still is a surface person um you know i mean my opinion uh and of course the opinion of child bride the book uh, but susan here she enjoyed you know, combing Elvis's hair, uh, just hanging out in the room, eating, talking. Um, all of the people that had, uh, had relationships with Elvis seemed to say the same thing, that he liked to make out, that he liked to um, read the Bible. He liked to discuss spiritual beliefs and thoughts um, and, and not just do the deed. And some women were disappointed because that's all they wanted. They wanted a piece of Elvis in that way. And, of course, you know, what, what would I say to those women? Well, if you didn't get it, you know, I don't feel bad for you. I mean, Elvis Presley had relationships and love with people that he wanted to have relationships and love with. Um, and Susan Henning was certainly one of these relationships. Here's another quote from Susan Henning. I feel very privileged that I think I got to know him at a time when I can honestly say I met one of the most beautiful human beings. And when you say not fake, certainly he could perform. But when the cameras were rolling, he performed. But off stage. What a beautiful person. How honest, real, and humble. How few men are humble like he was. And I think it was just a beautiful time in his life. She said, some men are good looking. Some have good personalities. But Elvis had it all. Please consider joining the channel. But hit that subscribe and all notifications and like.